so here we are in Istanbul, Turkey, um, where we are coming from the airport after being there for about two and a half, three hours, because um, our Turkish airline left Atlanta an hour and a half late. And so we missed our flight, our connecting flight to Rome. Yay for a great start to our holiday adventure. Uh, Turkish Airline did comp us a room and food. We've been at the, we, it's about 11.30 uh, p.m. and we have to get up at 4 a.m. to catch our next flight. So that's the what's so. So I'm going to take you on a little tour of our room in Istanbul. It's it's a nice room. Um, it's very cold here. It's kind of damp and rainy. And um, yeah, it it's not a bad room. And so this is what it looks like as we go through. And here's the bathroom, and oops, Daryl's taking the key out of the slot. And we're in the hallway now, and the lights are also have sensors in them as well throughout the building. It's kind of different. So you'll notice that the hallways will be dark until we step under one of the light sensors, and then the light will come on. So this is what the inside of this building looks like. It's a, I think it's a Wyndham Hotel uh, in Turkey. So we're getting ready to get on the elevator and go down and eat because we haven't eaten all day. And here is how their dining area is set up. Everything is nice and clean, but of course it's very different than what we're accustomed to. And they already have our plates set on the table. And we just sit and then they come and bring us um, the dishes that they've prepared. And here's a look at some of the things that we'll be eating. And the food was really delicious. The soup was good. Everything is halal. And um, so it was a tasty meal. And it wasn't because we're eating so late. Um, this is a little bit different than how we eat or how we move. So um, the meal was light enough that we could eat it and then go on to bed. And we have to get to bed because we have to be up at four in the morning. So another look at the the dining hall and you know, we're just going to go back up to our room and try to go to sleep, which will be very difficult considering that we'll only get about three hours of sleep before we have to get back up three or four hours. It's about 12 midnight now. So anyway, it's all part of the adventure and that's how we're going to look at it. I was a bit frustrated uh, because it was kind of difficult dealing with the airlines, but here we are. Well, Thanks for checking in on this video. As always, don't forget to like us, subscribe, and hit that bell. And wait for more adventures from the Turners.